Bernard Marx asked the question, we already passed 1.5C this year, did we not? Um, no. I mean, yes. No, yes. So we passed 1.5 on a daily basis. Um, there was a period about a um, little more than a week ago now. And this one went semi-viral just before the one went viral. So the first week of, of June, where global temperatures did average over 1.5 C over the uh, 1850 to 1900 IPCC baseline. And you can actually Google that and find articles saying that. And I actually published that and some very big names out there kind of stepped in it a little bit because they thought, oh my God, we breached 1.5 C way earlier than anybody thought. No, we have not breached 1.5 C in the way that the IPCC means it. And there's three different levels of this. And this is why this question is so good and why this is so confusing for people. The first level is, did the planet break 1.5 C for the day? Yes. In fact, you can trace breaking 1.5 or even 1.7 C back to 2016, right? This has happened before. It will happen again. That's not the same, right? The next level is having an entire year over 1.5 C. And that is now becoming increasingly likely next year. Um, and that you know, people will say, oh, it's been 1.5 C for a year, so we've broken 1.5. No, that is not what it means. The actual way this is phrased is that the, the long-term average has broken 1.5 C. And right now, the long-term average is going up by about 0.2 C per decade. So if we are a little bit over 1.2, let's call our let's call it 1.3, right? If we're 1.3 now, which we aren't, but if we were 1.3, then we have a full decade before we could really say, ah, now we're at 1.5. I mean, realistically, 1.5 for the long term. I mean, things can happen, um, right? But uh, you know, 2035 is a reasonable, um, but maybe more like maybe a little bit earlier than that. So yes, expect a year over 1.5, probably next year or the year after. Expect a couple of years in a row as we go on and then La Nina hits and it drops back again, all right? But to be solid, 1.5 or higher, probably uh, early, mid 2030s. Great.